This is the difference between imperative UI and declarative UI. In the imperative approach, we usually have the layout and the logic separated. In web development, we have HTML files that contain the structure of a web page and JavaScript files that can make changes to this HTML file. Imperative means that we have to tell our JavaScript code each step it has to do along the way. For example, when we click this button, after incrementing the counter, find the element in the HTML with the ID of the button and change the text inside it to this new value. The larger our apps get, the easier it is to mess this up because we have to micromanage all the changes in so many different places. In the declarative approach, we have the layout and the code that modifies it in the same file. In React, those are JSX files. Declarative means that we declare one time what data each element in the HTML should contain. And whenever we update this value, React automatically redraws the part of the UI that has to change. The benefit is that our UI is always in sync and we don't have to micromanage everything. 